a picnic in the park to celebrate the success of Parent Power. These campaigners have won their fight to save this play area at Kingshead Meadow in Wyndham after its future was put into jeopardy. There were plans to remove the play equipment from the site, but then protesters stepped in exactly a year ago today, hitting the national newspapers. The council decided, right, we're going to move it, we're going to bring in the contractors. There were a lot of us who didn't like that idea. And we said, oh no you don't. And as a result, there was a standoff. And basically, they couldn't move in, in their contractor's equipment in, they couldn't move their bulldozers and what have you in, because we were in the way. The argument stretches back several years, when the play area was expanded in 2014, costing £75,000. This led to noise complaints by some residents on nearby Orchard Way about teenagers hanging around the park in the evenings. But after a week of protesting and several meetings, there are now plans to remodel the area after Wyndham Town Council voted on proposals in June suggested by Play England. It's incredible that in a small town there's been such a diversity of voices speaking up about it and um, it's really just, it, it just shows that with that persistent mindset things can be changed and here we are a year on, the park is still here, brilliant. The recommendations by Play England involve removing a fence around the equipment and expanding the area so noise isn't focused in just one spot. Plans could also include more natural elements, such as fallen trees or boulders. I believe we've won the, uh, the battle, but we haven't won the war. And I think there's still a lot of work to be done um, for the equipment to be remodelled. Um, and hopefully at the September Council meeting there will be some information come forward that, um, that there has been a plan formulated to have it, to have it remodelled. A progress report on the redesign is due to be made at the town council meeting next month. But a year on from the day they block the bulldozers, it looks like it's the protesters who are having the last laugh. Christina Brinkley, Mustard TV, Wyndham.